program opens with Jesse Montgomery's Starburst for string orchestra composed in 2012. Jesse Montgomery was born in New York's Lower East Side in 1981. She grew up there in what she describes as, quote, a hotbed of cultural activity and community development where neighbors, activists, and artists gathered to celebrate and support the movements of the time, unquote. Starburst is the perfect concert opener, a brief, rhythmically energized, altogether luminous piece. Its luminosity is literal, as Montgomery defines a starburst as the rapid formation of large numbers of new stars in a galaxy at a rate high enough to alter the structure of the galaxy. Let's hear the opening of this three and one half minute piece. Aster Piazzolla, The Four Seasons of Buenos Aires, composed between 1965 and 1970. Piazzolla was born in 1921 in Argentina and died there in Buenos Aires in 1992. As a child, Piazzolla learned to play the bandoneon, an accordion-like instrument that instantly evokes Argentine tango. As a teenager, he went to work playing in tango bands before forming his own tango orchestra in 1946 at the age of 25. That was also the year that Piazzolla composed his first tango. Increasingly though, Piazzolla's ambition was to be a composer of concert music, and it is the fusion of his formal compositional training and his innate simpatico with the tango that led to his mature compositional language, a hybrid of tango and contemporary concert music. Piazzolla's The Four Seasons of Buenos Aires is just such a set of four concert tangos. We're going to hear The Four Seasons of Buenos Aires in an arrangement by the Russian composer Leonid Desyatnikov, born 1955, for solo violin and orchestra. Desyatnikov's arrangement, or should we more properly say, his recomposition, turns the four seasons of Buenos Aires into four miniature violin concerti, and thus it evokes Antonio Vivaldi's The Four Seasons of 1721, each of which is also a violin concerto. Let's hear the opening of Buenos Aires Spring as recomposed for solo violin and orchestra by Desyatnikov. <laughs> Florence Beatrice Price, Symphony No. 1 
in E minor, 1932. Florence B. Price was born in 1887 in Little Rock, Arkansas, and died in Chicago in 1953. Her Symphony No. 1 is a wonderful melding of the European symphonic tradition and the black American musical tradition. As an example, we turn to the third movement of Price's Symphony. Now, in an 18th or 19th century symphony, the third of its four movements typically consists of dance or dance-inspired music. So it is with Price's first symphony, the third movement of which is a juba dance, or hambone, a stomping African-American dance that turns the human body into a drum set that involves slapping and patting the arms, legs, and chest. We are going to hear the first minute and a half of Price's third movement, Juba Dance. The hand clapping and foot stomping are evoked by plucked strings and drums. The whistling one would hear during a Juba Dance is provided here by a slide whistle. Thank you.